37 units? We appear to be 6,963 units short. If we intend to keep our ship, Peter Quill. I know, I know. We clearly need a plan. What about selling Gamora's crap? What? Oh, come on. You've been hoarding them stupid knickknacks ever since you first joined us. I mean, don't tell me they ain't worth nothing. The quarantine zone was always a out on us. My a figurines are not knickknacks. Huh, team's in trouble. Then you can't be bothered to make no sacrifice. Of the I Star will system. sacrifice your head. And take us to the majestic mm, mountains yeah, of Kakarantara. Sure. Guys, I think we should hear our group for once. I am well, the only problem with your plan is that Lady Hellbender only buys monsters, and you are not a monster! Groot, are you really offering to- No, no, he is not offering that, okay? It could work. So, Groot, I guess we could bust him out after. Absurd! Lady Hellbender seeks the monster within. The small, ugly one is clearly the correct choice. He is cruel, sadistic, and his soul is filthy and filled with rage. I vote we sell Groot. I honestly think Lady Hellbender will go for it. Yeah, well, I vote for not. I also vote for the creepy little beast. Two votes each. Peter? Well, Rocket's definitely scarier on the inside. He's unstable and vicious and totally oblivious to the needs of others. <clears throat> okay, we, uh, we get it. All right, let's do this. Let's go sell a monster. We're not seriously flying into that. You say the weather patterns of Seknarf-9 are tied to the temperament of its ruler. That's not how women work. Or weather. We're flying the wrong way. Yeah, he's not flying at all. Guys, relax! Just one minor adjustment! I ever mentioned how much I hate rain? Hellbender's castle isn't even that far. That is not a castle. It is an impregnable fortress. So how do we impregnate it? Ask Peter! <laughs> <laughs> Let's just get closer. We'll figure it out on the way. There is nothing to figure out. As beast merchants, we will easily gain access to Lady Hellbender. Good! We've already got a beast. All that's left is the merchant part. Good thing I put on my official merchant costume. There is no such thing. Right? The fact you ain't sure don't bode so good. Whoa! That is some really crazy lightning out there! Never seen anything like it! Meteorological suicide is what it is! Out! Ugh. Hey, is my jacket all right? At least you got a jacket. Some of us are soaking here! Less whining, more walking! Hey, Stormlord! We ain't seriously walking through this. It'll take forever in this storm. Stop complaining. The hardship will strengthen your spirit. I face more than enough hardship. Thank you very much. You are welcome, Feeble One. We got this. Just don't fall and we'll be fine. Whoa! 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 Ah! Ah! Everyone okay? We should have gone to Maku 4. I would be wary, Rodin. Uh, you know, when I survive freaking half world, I think I'm scared of some little. Ah! It's not alone! Get ready! What are these things? They are amorphous vermin! Shoot first! Questions later! Drop them, Gamora! This won't hurt! Much! Smash him up, Drax! Meet your maker! Steel boys enjoying this way too much! This is the local fauna! It's about to be an endangered species! Groot! Hawkeye time! Ooh. Oh, you, Rocket! Time to go boom! I 
am eager to experience Lady Hellbender's legendary menagerie. Should we ask them for directions? I'm thinking maybe they are directions. Oh, like a signpost or something. I'm not saying it's an arrow with the word fortress on it, but statues suggest civilization, and the only settlement I saw when we were topside was Lady Hellbender's fortress. Dead end. That's just great. It's a retractable bridge. They used them at the prison I was in. Too bad the controls are on the other side of the giant chasm. We, what do you not have time to dawdle in this jungle? I shall hurl the creature over the chasm so he may activate the bridge. I may activate a hole through your face! Put me down! <laughs> It'll be fine. Just curl up in a ball. What? Drax, throw him. No! Very well! Peter! It's okay. He'll land on his feet. Ooh. Uh, I guess that only applies to cats. You sons of sharks! Scut busting ass! I am not familiar with these words. Order the beast to do its job. Fuck it! Come on, man! Ram it, fast face! Fix the bridge and we'll raise your cut by 5%. I want 10. Okay, deal. Thanks for the bridge, Rocket. If you even think of pulling that Wait, scud again. Hear that? Uh guys. I got it. Looking like we mean business. All right, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him. You better have one hell of a sales pitch. Maybe Gamora's right. We should try selling Groot instead. <laughs> what? Really? This is an affront to democracy. I just think that we might need Rocket on the outside for this one. Yeah, we noticed. You want to make that call, then you better not mess this up. You hang tight there, bud. When the time comes, I'll get you out of there. Rocket style if I got it. Drat. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as a leader. Oh, come on. Uh, don't look at me. I ain't pulling that thing. Remember, buddy, menacing! Like me, only uh, bigger. I am rude. Not bad. Not bad. Easy, big guy. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. We got this! Rocky, what are you doing? Stop! 
Guardians of the Galaxy. How many times do I have to kill you? The audacity that you thought you could rob me. Dweller, feast upon them!